Over time, the battery in the S10 Plus starts to lose its power, and then you might find yourself charging your phone a bajillion times a day. If you want to get back to charging it just once a day, then keep watching. We're about to show you how to replace the battery on your Samsung Galaxy S10 Plus. For this repair, you'll need iFixit opening tools, a suction handle, a set of iFixit opening picks, tweezers, a Phillips 00 screwdriver, an eye opener, a spudger, and some over 90% isopropyl alcohol or adhesive remover. We also recommend using a magnetic mat to keep screws organized and safe. The Galaxy S10 Plus has a ton of tiny screws that are very easy to lose, and this mat will keep them all in place. Before you begin your repair, make sure to discharge your battery below 25%. This will reduce the risk of a dangerous thermal event if you puncture your battery during the repair. Once you're ready to get started, heat up an eye opener and lay it across the right edge of the back cover. Lay a suction cup on the back of the phone as close as possible to where you applied the heat and pull up on the suction cup to create a gap between the back cover and the case. Once you have a gap, use the pick to cut away the adhesive, then leave your pick in place to prevent the back cover from resealing. Repeat the process of heating, lifting with the suction cup, and using your pick all around the phone. If the adhesive continues to give you a hard time, try using a heat gun or a hairdryer. Once you've cut the adhesive from all around the phone, twist the inserted picks to help separate the back cover from the frame. Once it's free, you should be able to lift it right off. Go ahead and remove the 16 Phillips screws from the NFC antenna charging coil and speaker. Then use the tip of your spudger to remove them both from the phone. With your spudger still in hand, disconnect the battery to cut off power. Grab your isopropyl alcohol and begin to drop some into the battery well. Let it set and soften the adhesive, then lift the edge and tilt the phone so the alcohol travels. You can add some more alcohol at this time if you wish. Wait for about a minute for the adhesive to finish softening and then grab a plastic card or opening pick and pry up the battery. If the battery doesn't budge, the adhesive is not sufficiently weakened. Reapply more alcohol or try using some adhesive remover. With the old battery out, grab your new battery and apply new adhesive so that your battery doesn't rattle around. Lay your battery back inside the well and reconnect it to the motherboard. Then go ahead and insert the NFC antenna charging coil and speaker and screw everything back in. With all that back in place and new adhesive applied to your rear panel, you can carefully close up the phone. 